Hi, I'm Zach Ward. Welcome to Keeper of the Mountain. Why don't you come on in and let's watch a video together. Come on, what are you waiting for? You know, rednecks are awesome. We come from a long line of people that just build something out of nothing or with what we got or what we're interested in. And we make, make things do and make some really cool stuff along the way. And, you know, I've shown you a few things like the mailbox that my brother built to, to, for the, you know, the redneck mailbox, things like that. But when I'm driving around, I like to see what other rednecks come up with. And here's something I found just driving through Oregon. I'm on my way to Tillamook to go visit the cheese factory and I'm driving down this lonely backcountry road and I just had to stop and film this. And here's what some rednecks came up with. They have a planter box next to their gate. Their gate's interesting, but I gotta show you the planter box first. Here's their planter box. This is a shovel from an old steam shovel. Yeah, see the big teeth on it? And they just planted some Oregon grape in it. That's pretty cool, but this is really cool. They've got this massive metal gate. And they needed to put a counterbalance because that's a lot of weight. So this is a big chunk of iron right here. We won't go in because it's private, but that's a, that's a heavy stinking gate, right? And it's all hanging off the pivot here. So what are you gonna use on this massive gate to keep all that weight from wearing out your pivot point? Well. What better than a rat motor? That's right, here we have a big block Chevy V8. Just hanging on the back end. There's no guts in it. There's no crank in it. There's a water pump on it. And there's a manifold, valve cover, some worn out headers. Yeah, it's probably a, just a boat anchor of a motor, probably just a core that's not worth anything. But they have it bolted and then the bolts are welded so you can't steal it which is good I wouldn't steal it anyway but somebody would you know scrappers they might come by and everything but I just thought that was pretty cool to hang a motor on the back of your gate and then I got to look and they got the other half of the gate here and they got another rat motor hanging on the other end there I just thought that was really cool and inventive and and these people they they just they got it going on they this is their personalized gate and that's just the way rednecks do things. It works for them, it, it's individualized, you're not gonna see one everywhere you go. And I'm thinking that's just the way it ought to be. Thank you very much for watching this video and I hope you come back later and watch another one soon.